Hey guys, how you doing you beautiful, gorgeous people of the web? And thank you as always for clicking on my channel. Um, if you guys are new, my name is James and I'm from the UK and I'm a lover of all kinds of music. And for the people clicking on this channel, um, I just want to say like thank you um, so much of, of us discovering Elvis Presley together and like there's been so many now when I try and do the Elvis ones and then I've got people that are Madonna fans that also ask me to do Madonna as well so I try and do it or make it a thing to at least try and do one Elvis and one Madonna um, every week and then the thing that I like that is exciting about Elvis is I'm learning a lot of new songs or interpretations of cover songs that he has done and discovering the amazing artist that he was and the legacy that he has left behind and continues to inspire so even when I'm kind of watching all these performances even, even of songs that I know like Frank Sinatra is my way I'm just blown away by his interpretation and just learning so much about his his skill and his craft and just how amazing he truly was as an artist which is why he resonates and his legacy will always continue mm. so um yeah today somebody asked me to react to memories I'm not sure that I know this song either and this is from the 68 1968 comeback special 50th anniversary so uh, before we do like I always said I uh, do not claim any of the copyrighted material that belongs entirely to Elvis and the record label so please go out purchase stream support and buy Elvis because he deserves it um, and if you are new to my channel guys then please do click the link below and click subscribe and uh, do not forget you know the drill guys to give the video I like it. So I want to say a quick, like, I do read everyone's comments, but I always see, like, particular people. So I'm going to say hello to Paula, Theodora. Um, I'm trying to think of people whose comments I read off the top of my head. And it's early morning in the UK. I've just been swimming. So, yeah, I'm just trying to think of um, people. So I will give people a little shout out. And I do appreciate all your support and stories and comments. So let me know what you think of this song and um, the memories you have associated with it. And, um, yeah, without further ado, let's continue on to the video, guys. quick i said this and i think i can't believe i never knew this about elvis's voice apart from seeing his live performances but i feel like that elvis presley's songs that i know are the ones that are really air candy and really the popular songs um i really find i've said it in previous videos but his lower tone and baritone part of his voice is so rich and full that he's just you can just hear the control and the command and I think it's absolutely incredible that he has that control, that low down and it's like so full and it's got so much light and shade to it and I said that in um, I think when he did My Way as well because I know Elvis songs where like he's got such a wide range I think that's what I'm trying to say I never knew that his voice had so much um, power to it and and even when he does do the low notes like that it's still got that command that kind of really draws you in and um, I love how you can definitely tell this is approaching like the 1970s. It just has that kind of look because I like like the Bee Gees and, and people from that kind of era as well. Um, and I love, love, love the Beach Boys. Um, and yeah, he's got his iconic outfit on again, his kind of leather jacket. And I can't believe how close those fans are to him as well. Can you imagine being sat that close to the king? That's like amazing. They're probably going to tell that story to the grandchildren or something. But yeah, let, let's continue, guys. 
Quiet thoughts come floating down and settle softly to the ground like gold of autumn leaves around my feet. I touch them and they burst apart with sweet memories. Memories of holding hands and red bouquets and twilight's kindled and purple haze and laughing eyes and supple ways and quiet nights and gentle days with you. Between the pages of my mind. He's doing that thing that I said. I'm only pausing for copyright reasons, guys. We know how annoying it is, but um, he does that thing, Elvis. And I've, I, I've all, I already know that. I feel like I'm becoming familiar with his performance skills, but he always has that conviction, and that's what I said. I always like artists where they're truthful with emotion because it's not just about the voice necessarily. It's about the connection and the conviction and the truthfulness in in conveying that that sense of truth and element of truth when you're singing lyrics and that's what singing and storytelling is it's that's that's what we like when like you can always listen to songs and say oh this song reminds me of a particularly emotional moment or friendship or relationship and i feel like when elvis sings he always kind of goes within his eyes and he, he reaches that storytelling aspect and able to give the song his own element of truth and authenticity and i think what i think is amazing about elvis as well is that when you get a star like Elvis um, or even later you can have those stars where when a male kind of star reaches it sometimes like a male audience can somewhat find that intimidating um, in regards to like because they have such a huge fan base of like really good looking girls and stuff but with Elvis I feel like so many people and it doesn't matter of age um, of, of um, race of of gender or anything like i feel like everyone just was on par of understanding what elvis was as a moment in time and just understanding that an artist like elvis like will probably well will never happen again do you know what i mean you get certain artists where they come once in a lifetime and they leave such a profound impact almost like a like a volcano where it just literally leaves its mark where you know that you'll never get that again and I think that's what's really special. And I have artists like that in my lifetime who I'm a fan of, obviously, because um, I wasn't born then when Elvis came out. But I, I say that now and I can tell I'm reaching that age now where I say it to people like, oh, you'll never understand like music today. You know, I, re I remember my dad always saying that. He was like, the older that you get, you'll look back or you'll see people cover songs that were the originals when you were a boy or, or like you'll just think music today is really boring and compare it to your childhood and i've started doing that now i'm getting old um, but yeah let's continue but what a beautiful song i don't know this song as well I've got the goosebumps again. I've got it. I found my hair on my legs. Press between the pages of my mind. Memories sweetened through the ages just like one. Memories, sweet memories. 
beautiful song. Like, I really like that. Um, it sounds like a musical kind of song, and I like the fact that I've not heard an Elvis song that has that kind of... Um, he just really stripped it back, but it shows that even when he strips it back and it's not hitting high notes, that it's still as impressive because of his resonance and just, it's just a really beautiful song and it's put me in a really happy Monday mood. What a beautiful reaction and song to start my week and um, share it with you guys as well. Um, I, tell me about the song, guys. Like I said, I like learning from you guys. So is it is that his original or is that a cover or is it? I don't know, it sounds like a song from a musical or something, but I just loved how it was just a very summer, laid back, puts you in a positive mood, very Carpenters kind of vibe kind of song, like, um, why do birds suddenly appear? It kind of had that kind of feeling to it where it just made you feel really safe and warm and happy and and things like that um but yeah another amazing vocal and it just shows that even when he strips it back is its ability to is elvis's ability to connect and feel the emotion and just show how impressive his actual tone of voices as well to pull off a song like that as well because he doesn't need to always show his impressive elements of his voice but even a song like that which was so simple melodically and lyrically it was just a really equally as impressive as his normal vocal stylings and normal ear candy songs um but yeah that is my reaction to memories guys and yeah thank you so much and as always i hope you and your families are all safe and i hope you've had a lovely weekend and yeah thank you so much and like i said if you are new to my channel guys please do subscribe and click the link below and do not forget to give the video a like it so um yeah thank you so so much guys and i look forward to your beautiful comments. Bye.